The NCAA Division II defending national champion Central Missouri men's basketball team showed off for a home crowd at the multi-purpose building in Warrensburg for the first time in this 2014-2015 season on Tuesday, November 18. Under the direction of new head coach Doug Carlskant, the Mules welcome in Missouri SMT from Rolla for UCM's third official game of the season. Right off the bat, Preston Bruns finds Brad Woodson wide open in the corner. Woodson drains a three. The crowd loves it. 30 seconds into the game, Central Missouri is on the board first. More from the first half, Brennan Hughes grabs the offensive rebound, scores on the putback, and draws a foul. 12-9 mules at the 16-49 mark. Missouri S&T playing very well here in the first half. Miners take the lead, but UCM doesn't let it get out of hand. Rakeem Dickerson stops for the jumper at the foul line. It bounces in. Mules down 2018, about 10 minutes in. 5.45 on the clock when Tony Cochran takes a shot from the top of the key. Three for Cochran. We're all tied up, 28-28. Momentum starts to swing the Mules' way with 3.24 until half. Dickerson dishes to Dylan Deck. Easy lay-in for Deck. UCM on top now, 34-31. Mules push that out to a 12-point lead on a three from Bruns, 43-31. Bruns and T.J. White finish off the first half with some acrobatics. Central Missouri heads into the locker room, leading Missouri S&T by 16-47-31. The Miners did not score in the last four minutes of the first half. Let's move to the second half. White grabs a loose ball, goes on the coast-to-coast -coast run. Layup is good, 22-point lead for UCN. 15-44 to play, ball gets over to Jordan Epps, knocks down the three-pointer, UCM up 60-39. About halfway through this half, it's newcomer Dante Adams banks the ball off the glass, 72-51 mules. 7.30 on the clock, Dickerson to Sean O'Brien. He slams the dunk, 30-point lead for UCM, 83-53. Central Missouri goes on to beat Missouri S&T 93-70, giving head coach Doug Carlskant his first win in the UCM multi-purpose building. I've been in this building on the opposite sideline, and, and you know, you just you always walk in here and it, it's an intimidating place, you know, and it's so nice to be on the mule sideline, you know, and, and I've been waiting for this day to, for so long. And, uh, you know, it, it was a good win against a, a, a team from s and that, that will win some games. So uh, proud of our effort. Uh, I know the guys know that, that we've got to get a lot better, but it's a good foundation, good, good win number one here at home. The Mules shot almost 62% from the floor and went 10 of 18 from three-point range. 51 of the 93 points came from the UCM bench. The Mules also scored 24 points off turnovers. Rakeem Dickerson and TJ White both finished with 17 points. White put up a double-double with 12 rebounds. Dickerson had 10 assists and 5 steals. Yeah, you know, I think the guys were almost so excited to play at home. We had talked about it. You know, uh, the guys were in the gym all day long, you know, because of the excitement of playing that first home game. You know, and I thought that uh, we had some jitterbugs early on, but once we got settled in, I thought we, we executed pretty well. The 3-0 Mules have had a different leading scorer in each game so far. We're really versatile. I think that our depth is, is pretty good. You know, uh, I think that we can do a little bit of everything. I think that offensively we can go inside. we got some pretty good shooters to stretch the defense. Uh, defensively we can throw a lot, a lot of things at the opponent. So uh, I like our versatility. But as a whole, we just got to shore up some things get better. It's two games in a row at the Multi for the Mules. Central Missouri welcomes in Westminster College from Fulton, Missouri on Saturday, November 22nd. Tip-off is scheduled for 4 p.m. For UCMAthletics.com, I'm Katie Smith.